around the rim would mean that it's on the disc. It's away from the disc. It's measured. You're measuring nerve fiber layer away from the disc. 3.45 millimeters exact, to be precise, from the center of the disc. Okay, that's where the OCT measures it. And this one is 3.25 millimeter from the center of the disc. The point is, you're measuring away from the disc. So, you, if you want to want to give a definition for T-slit average, 360 degree retinal nerve fiber layer average around the disc, not the rim. Okay, what does superior average stand for? Loudly, please. Okay, what does inferior average stand for? Okay, if you look at nasal and temporal, it is not 120 degrees because you don't have, you only have 360 degrees. Nasal is 70 degrees and temporal is 50 degrees, but those values are not given. Nasal and temporal average are not helpful in diagnosing glaucoma. Okay, right, I'm glad now we actually fixed that. So now you know all the parameters. Okay. Has everyone finished the preparation report? Anyone still working on it? You're working on it? Continue working. We'll give you another five minutes. Can you rely on the cornea thickness in here or not? Is what does cornea thickness have to do with this? You, you never want to know? Cornea thickness is for glaucoma, David. We're looking at imaging right now, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, yeah, but is this, like it says, cornea But do you remember that uh, polarimeter measures corneal polarization? It's not corneal thickness, it's not. Telling you the polarization properties of cornea and tracking that and giving the nerve fiber layer. 